telung puluh tahun luweh dan Trimble ambek bujuni ketok rukun rukunai. Sopong ngira rumah tangga ni molak malik mari anak e Alicia pegatan ambek bujuni. Seeing how I came through it in a better place kind of pushed them to stand up and say I'm not happy in my own marriage. Gak suwe anak e sing paling cilik melok pegatan. That same contagious thing that transferred from Alicia and her situation to my former spouse and me transferred right on down the line to Courtney and her spouse. My sister's my best friend. So to know that she made it through definitely helped me realize that it wasn't something I couldn't handle. Nek wong teko nengone kawinan biasane kabeh padha ndongakno ben sing kawin iso langgeng pernikahane. Tapi nyatane rumah tangga gak kabeh iso langgeng. Bahkan menurut penelitian, bila seseorang itu kenal dekat dengan orang yang pernah cerai, maka kemungkinan dia juga ikut pegatan munggah 100%. Menurut sebagian pengamat, memang faktor keluarga dan teman dekat sangat menentukan. This spreads in more or less the same way. When one person experiences divorce, it gives the people around them information about what that's like. Ini didasarkan pada penelitian oleh Fowler dan rekan-rekannya selama sekitar 10 tahun. Banyak hal seperti kebiasaan merokok, minum alkohol, atau makan berlebihan juga ditularkan oleh orang dekat. Your friends influence you, also your siblings influence you, even your co-workers influence you. When they get divorced, it increases the likelihood that you'll get divorced. 